This cream is used to moisturize and treat dry, rough, scaly, itchy skin, as well as minor skin irritations like diaper rash and skin burns from radiation therapy. It contains substances that soften and moisturize the skin, reducing itching and flaking. Some ingredients are used to protect the skin from irritation, and others work by trapping water in the skin. The cream also contains ingredients that draw water into the outer layer of the skin and soften the top layer of skin cells, helping to keep the skin hydrated and feeling smoother and softer. Use as directed by your doctor or pharmacist. Make sure to use Americarin cream as directed, and some products may need to be shaken before use, so be sure to check the label. Apply the cream to the affected areas of the skin as needed or as directed by your doctor. The frequency of application will depend on your skin condition and the product. For example, if you're treating dry hands, you may need to use the cream every time you wash your hands, applying it throughout the day. If you're using Americarin cream to help treat diaper rash, be sure to clean the diaper area well before use and allow it to dry before application. And if you're using the cream to help treat radiation skin burns, check with radiation personnel to see if your brand can be applied before radiation therapy. Remember to follow all the directions on the label for proper use, and apply the cream to the skin only. Avoid sensitive areas like your eyes, inside your mouth slash nose, and the vaginal slash groin area, unless directed by the label or your doctor. Also, be sure to check the label for any specific areas or types of skin where the cream should not be applied, and consult your doctor or pharmacist for more details. It's important to use Americarin cream regularly to get the most benefit from it, and most moisturizers need water to work well. Apply the cream after bathing or showering while the skin is still damp. If your skin is very dry, your doctor may instruct you to soak the area before using the cream. And remember, long, hot, or frequent bathing slash washing can worsen dry skin. If your condition lasts or gets worse, or if you think you may have a serious medical problem, be sure to seek medical help right away. Using Americarin cream is generally safe and effective, but some people may experience burning, stinging, redness, or irritation. If these effects persist or worsen, it's important to consult your doctor or pharmacist. If your doctor has prescribed this medication, it means that they have determined the benefits outweigh the risk of potential side effects. Most people using this medication do not experience serious side effects but should still be aware of any unusual changes in the skin or signs of infection. While serious allergic reactions to Americarin cream are rare, seek medical help immediately if you notice symptoms such as rash, itching, swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. It's important to note that this is not a complete list of possible side effects, so be sure to consult your doctor or pharmacist if you notice any other effects not mentioned. As always, it's important to consult with your doctor for medical advice about any side effects and to report them to the appropriate regulatory agency in your country. Before using Americarin cream, make sure to consult your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies or skin cuts slash infections slash sores. Some ingredients in the cream may make you more sensitive to the sun, so it's important to check the label for any warnings and take special precautions when in the sun. If you have acne-prone skin, look for the word non-comedogenic on the label to avoid worsening acne. It's also important to inform your doctor about all the products you use before having surgery. If you are pregnant or breastfeeding, consult your doctor before using Americarin cream, especially if you are applying it to the breast area. It's important to be aware that Americarin cream may interact with other medications and potentially change how they work or increase the risk of serious side effects. It's crucial to keep a list of all the products you use, including prescription and non-prescription drugs, as well as herbal products, and share this list with your doctor and pharmacist. It's essential to not start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without the approval of your doctor. If this medication is swallowed, it can be harmful, especially if taken in large amounts. If someone has taken too much and is experiencing severe symptoms like fainting or difficulty breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical help by calling 911 or contacting a poison control center. In the U.S., you can reach out to your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222, and in Canada, residents can call a provincial poison control center for assistance. When it comes to preventing dry skin, there are a few simple tips to keep in mind. Firstly, opt for lukewarm water instead of hot water when bathing, 
and try to limit your baths or showers to every one to two days. Keep your baths or showers short, and consider using a humidifier if the air is particularly dry. Now, let's talk about Americarin Cream. This emollient product comes in various forms such as oils, creams, lotions, or sprays. It's important to consult with your doctor or pharmacist to determine which form is best for you. Americarin Cream can help moisturize and soothe dry skin, so it's important to use it as directed for optimal results. Consider using it at a consistent time each day, such as after bathing or before bedtime. Always follow the recommended dosage and usage instructions provided by your healthcare professional. If you forget to use Americarin cream on your regular schedule, just use it as soon as you remember. But do not use extra cream or use it more frequently than directed to make up for the missed dose. Be sure to check the storage instructions on the package. If you have any questions about how to store Americarin cream, ask your pharmacist. It's important to keep all medications out of reach of children and pets. Avoid storing the foam canister near high heat or open flames, as it is pressurized. Do not puncture or burn the canister. When it comes to disposing of Americarin cream, do not flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless specifically instructed to do so. Be sure to properly discard the product when it's expired or no longer needed, and you can consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for guidance. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.